Welcome back. You've probably seen them in a lot of places. Now hiring signs are posted on just about every storefront. In this morning's Don't Waste Your Money report, John Mattery shares the incentives that may be too good to pass up. We'll get um, a bunch of uh, people who will send in applications and then not respond. Or we'll get people signed up for interviews that won't appear. It's a common problem across America. There's plenty of openings, but no workers. And for bakery manager Kelly Morton, finding help has been no small task. Hiring has been difficult all year, but it's especially difficult now just because there are so many amazing small businesses, just businesses in general, looking for that extra holiday help. Experts at the McCombs Business School at the University of Texas at Austin tell us that this is the seller's market when it comes to jobs. I think you have a choice of deciding where you want to work, and I think you might even be in a position to negotiate these entry-level jobs, which is something that's been unheard of in previous years. With finding workers such a challenge right now, even bakeries have to offer extra incentives to get workers this holiday season. When you're working on your shift, you get to eat basically whatever you want. With workers in the driver's seat, experts say ask for even better pay, better benefits, even more vacation if you're going for that full-time gig. They tell us to be choosy because you can. Whether it's the Nordstrom or it's, you know, your Sam's Club or Costco or Walmart, and the kinds of salaries you're being you're seeing being offered are 18, 17, 20 dollars, all kinds of benefits, including, for example, I'm told college tuition. I mean, I think that seems to me um, something that we've never seen. But they warn this won't last long, so take advantage of it while you can, so you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.